channel so today I'm going to share with you a thrift haul my mother come came down to my house last weekend and we went to a couple thrift stores uh, local to me and y'all we went because she wanted to go but I'm the one that racked up so I thought I would share with y'all what I've got some is seasonal decor some I was thinking ahead for like spring and summer and so let's get started i'm so excited to show you what i found so first off this piece that i bought she fell in love with it she's like donna you've got to get it and i agreed because i loved it i just there was something about it i was just drawn to it and so i had to get it and it's this cake topper like cake stand topper and i paid 3.99 for this and i have set it on top of my great grandmother's bait, you know, cake stand. And I have it on the center of my bar and I will insert a picture and show you what that looks like. And I just absolutely love it. It was so beautiful. I just, I don't know. There was just something about it I was drawn to and I could not resist it. So I picked that up. My second holiday decor piece, I actually got two just like these and they are simply gorgeous. I paid $6.99 each for them, and they originally retailed. The sticker was still on it. I don't know if you can see it, but they originally retailed for $54.99, and I paid $6.99 each. And what I love about these is they're very good quality. They're very well made. And these will last me into winter as well. So I've put one on my front door and one on my back door and I just love them. I just think they're absolutely beautiful. So I snatched both of those. Okay. I also picked up a garland. It was about, I guess you could say it was about four foot. Very, very nice garland. I've already displayed it um, on top of my shelf in the dining room. I will insert a picture of that and I also paid $6.99 for that and it's just, it's so full and beautiful and I love it. And me and her went back and forth on that one because she wanted it, I wanted it, I tried to give it to her, she said, no, you take it. So I ended up with it <laughs> uh, and put it on my shelf in the kitchen. And my last piece of holiday decor is this. How cute is that? And it is the Potter Studio. And I've already taken the sticker off of it, but I paid $2.99 for this. And I just absolutely love it. It is just so cute. I was so happy to find it and I had to get it because it's in perfect condition. There was absolutely nothing wrong with it. So that's all of the holiday decor that I purchased. But moving on to like everyday decor and I'm thinking spring and summer and I'll tell you what I had in mind when I purchased each one. So... For the next piece, I bought this. It's cute. I actually think I'm gonna paint this because it is kind of rusted, but I only paid 99 cents for it. And I just thought it was so cute. I mean, this can just kind of sit anywhere and I just loved it, so I bought it. <laughs> okay. Now this piece I bought, um, I bought in mind to like do a paint technique on it. Um, so I don't really know what I'll end up doing, but it's this pig cutting board and look how thick the sucker is. It is so thick and it's so cute. I just love it. And I paid $2.99 for it. And you could actually use it as a cutting board because it looks like they have, or um, just a display like uh, some decor. So I just love it. James, I think is gonna try to use this as a template and cut this out. And I've thought about doing some kind of paint technique on it because I wouldn't use it as a cutting board. But anyway, I just loved it, $2.99. I thought that's a chunk of wood for $2.99. <laughs> okay, let's see. I also bought this old platter and it's really, really old. And you can see it's got the stamp on the back. And I paid $2.99 for that. And I just love it. I love old dishes. And I mean, 
This is a really old piece for $2.99, and I just think it's so beautiful because, I mean, you can display this. Um, this will look so good. I actually have a place in mind already for this when I take down all my Christmas decor, so I really, really love this. Okay, so this piece, I bought this frame, and I don't know if you can see, it's kind of set up it's a deep. Anyway, I paid $3.99 for this. It's a beautiful frame as is, as you can see the frame. And it's a beautiful picture as is. But I bought this. I'm going to um, do a DIY on this. And, of course, I'm going to film it. But I really love this. And I may. You'll see. I have something in mind for this. I bought this for, for $0.99. Cents. And I'm actually thinking about getting James to cut me a piece of wood and putting this on the back. I mean, on the front, I have the wood on the back. So that's what I bought this for. To me, I just love You could paint it, you could leave it as is, but I really, really love it. And I'm thinking about, you know, sprucing it up a little bit. All right. I also grabbed this shelf liner. It was 99 cents. I'm sure you can get stuff like this at Dollar Tree, but I actually needed some of this and I like the print on it. So I just picked it up, 99 cents. Okay, and then let's, oh, I have some more goodies on this side. Okay, now this piece I was thinking of spring and I bought this beautiful vase. You can tell it was probably expensive. There wasn't a price on it, but the guy come up and I got this for a dollar. And I just think it's absolutely beautiful. And I can just see some beautiful spring florals in here. And actually, you could use this for Christmas anytime, honestly. I just love it. So, pick that up. I picked up these pack of shower hooks. Not to use as shower hooks, but they were $1.99. But I actually picked them up to use them as, like, little knobs. Um like for DIYs and stuff for $1.99 and they're so cute. Um, I picked those up for that. I also picked up this Southern Living ribbon, this wire ribbon and it's really wide. I got it for $2.99. I love the color. I'm actually thinking about making me a big bow, maybe to go on the bottom of my wreath or maybe take the red bird off and put it at the top of my wreath for like winter. But I love this ribbon and I love the color and it is wired. And I thought that was a pretty good deal. I picked up this tray and I paid $3.99 for it. And I, I know it was messed up right here, but I actually picked this up because um, I thought about doing some kind of paint technique on it. Um, or I may leave it as is and just set some stuff on it. I don't know, but I just thought it was really, really pretty. And for $3.99, I thought it was a pretty good deal. Thinking of spring, I picked this up, this cute little flower pot. I paid $3.99 for it. I love the silver. And as you can see, I'm kind of thinking of incorporating this into some of my home decor. And um, yeah, this could be used as a flower pot, what it's intended for. Or you could put like makeup brushes in it. Um, you could put a little faux plant in it. Just the possibilities are endless. You could like put like your scissors and paint brushes and stuff like this for your craft room or whatever. And I just thought it was really, really cute. And for $3.99, I thought that was a pretty good deal. I didn't mind paying that for that. Now, thinking of Valentine and DIYs, I picked this up. And I have an uh, idea what I'm going to do with this. And I paid $1.99 for it. And I think it's going to be really cute once I get through fixing it up. I mean, it's cute as is. If you like that. And that goes with your home decor. But I bought it with the intention of doing a DIY. Now, this item I bought with summer in mind. Because y'all know I love to do my red, whites, and blues in the summertime. And I love this because to me, it kind of just said summertime. Now this is an old crock. I paid $3.99 for it. And I don't know if it 
was originally bought with this on it or somebody put it on it. But I really didn't mind it on there because watermelon in summertime, I just thought it was really cute. So I picked that up for $3.99. And then my last item I paid, I bought this, this little tray. And I paid $1.99 for it. And my original idea when I saw this was uh, I'm gonna get James to cut me out a piece of wood, stain it, put it in here, and have a cute little tray. Or you could like, if you didn't wanna do something like that, you could stand it up and just put it in a little vignette. I mean, it's really cute possibility. You could set a plan on it. I mean, whatever. <laughs> whatever you wanted to do with it. I just loved it. And it's very well made and I liked the patina on it. So I picked that up. And that's it for all my goodies. I was so tickled to get those wreaths. I was so tickled to get that cake topper cover. To me is just, that was just sold the whole trip for me. We had a lot of fun. Um, like I said, it was her idea, but I think I ended up, she got some pretty good stuff, but um, I loved everything that I got. So let me know in the comment section, which was your favorite. Um, I really can't decide because I love it all, but the, the wreaths, I really love those wreaths. But anyway, I can't pick just one. <laughs> That's why I bought them all. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, I would love it if you would hit that little red subscribe button. And if you're on Instagram, go follow me on Instagram. I'd love to connect with you over there as well. And until next time, I hope you have a great day and I'll see you next time. Bye.